Hey, what is going on, Madden family? We got Legends Saturday today. Some good ones. Uh, Bruce Matthews, Allen Page, who I believe is new to Mutt, and Daryl Green. Now, I know Daryl Green is short. I get it. He's fast. Now, there's a couple minor things I want to talk about before we actually get into all this stuff. One, not sure why we don't have harvest packs um, today. I, I, I don't know. I don't, I don't know why there's not Harvest Legend packs or something. I don't know. It seems weird. Um, and then two, uh, when we added uh, the, the physical chemistry slot to the Masters yesterday, I thought it was a great move. And we, we, we took one step forward, but we stayed sort of where we are with limited edition cards because they, they need Sprinter as well because it, it really does their value kind of takes a hit. Um, and it's, it's more emphasized than ever, in my opinion, than someone like Daryl Green, who comes out as the fastest card in the game. Just on this base card, fastest card in the game. Uh, let's take a look at him. Daryl, Daryl, where's Daryl? There he is. So he comes out with 95 speed, right? Amazing, amazing. I know it's short, but like he's one faster than Power of Dion. But Power of Dion can get Sprinter, so he's actually faster. Um, which is, I, I just I wish he could get Sprinter. I wish all the limiteds could get Sprinter, and it's really emphasized here. Is we're bringing a legend into the game who is notoriously fast, fastest man in the NFL. And then, because of chemistry, is the highest rated corner in the game. Tied for the highest rated card in the game. Fastest man in the NFL. He's not the fastest card on your team. That's a problem. It's, it's, it's a problem. Uh, now, otherwise, we see the prices of Walter and Lawrence coming down, which, which I like. Uh, Alan Page looks really, really good. Um... He, he's he's the uh, the shake to Mean Joe's bake, essentially, right? Less block shed, less power move, less strength, faster, much better finesse move. Alan Page is probably the better card. He's probably the better card. He's probably really good. <laughs> he's probably really good. We might actually get him and try him out. Uh, and then there's... Uh, Bruce Matthews, who I think is is also a great legend card, a great card to have back in the game. Uh, unfortunately for me, the way I like to play with Alex Mack on my team for chemistry, uh, I don't know if we'll get Bruce. We might just because I mean, look, he's so much better. Like five pass block power, five pass block finesse, two run block, three strength. Like Bruce is really good. Um, I don't know. We might. We might. We got the coins. We might. Um, but if we do that, what's going to happen to our team is we're going to lose our plus one speed in our Falcons. Uh, because we're not going to be able to have these two guys in here. And we need 25. Ex we have exactly 25 right now. So I would need to find another way to fit a Falcon in somewhere. Oh, let me see this guy. This guy. We got bored this week. Go boards. Let's say I uh, just just so you guys see. Everyone says best quarterbacks in the game. That my, that my Ryan's pretty good. Um, I just wish there was another place I could throw a Falcon in here. I'd, I'd have to do it at middle linebacker, honestly. And then, yeah, I'd have to get. I'd have to take Erlacher out, which sort of sucks. Sort of sucks. I don't know. Um, let's try the Legend Fantasy Packs first. Let's see. Um, and maybe we'll we'll rip the Harvest Bundle instead. Because uh, Legend Fantasy Packs, well, they're, they're, they're okay packs. They're not my favorite packs. There's a, there's a hair on the microphone. Uh, not my favorite packs. We haven't pulled a full limited Legend all year out of these packs, regardless. So... Are these really the best move for us? I don't know. Tavon Fowler. Good. And I would rather work towards the LT and the Walter Payton. Probably. 
And that's essentially what we'd be doing there. Paul Krause or Deion Sanders? We'll take Deion Sanders. So we're going to open one more with coins. We'll see how it is. And then we're going to make a decision which way we want to go. Because I would like to get closer to Walter, closer to Lawrence Taylor. Those are the cards I would like to add more to my team. 100%. One, like 100% more. And with getting 30-something packs, you've just got to figure you've got a better chance of pulling something. As opposed to 8 packs. That's not bad. We'll open one more. One more. That wasn't bad. The 87 Travis Frederick. I know he's not super expensive anymore, but I, I don't hate that card. I don't hate that pull. I do like seeing the better cards in these packs now. What? This is a juice. This pack is juiced. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. Thanksgiving. Big, big. It's a 10,000 coin card. <sighs> okay, one more. One more of these. Then, uh, I don't know. I'm, I might just do another pack opening for the Harvest Bundle because the 30 packs, or what, what, it's, I think it's 30 packs, it's going to take a while to go through. And that would make this video really, really long. And I don't know if I want to give you guys like a 20 minute video today. I'd rather give you two smaller videos. Better be good. One more. We've opened four. We haven't pulled, we haven't pulled anything. We're just losing. We're, we're bleeding coins out of this. But I do... Where is the limited edition legend card? I can't believe we haven't pulled one. Any of them. Any of them. It just blows my mind. It blows my mind that we've opened this many packs. We'll just keep going. We'll just open all these. We're we're already down. Whatever. Um, but it blows my mind that we've opened this many Legend Fantasy packs, this many packs in general on the weekends, and haven't pulled them. Now, I know the, we all know the pull rate for limited edition cards is really, really, really bad um, in Legend Fantasy packs. I mean, opening those coins is, is a real, I think it's such a bad idea. I mean, look, look at like what you get generally. I mean, I'm going to lose 500k. I'm going to lose 500k on these packs, which is like half of Lawrence Taylor. But it is what it is. Come on. Change these packs, man. Change these packs. This is a big one. That's a big one. We we stack all these coins. <laughs> we're gonna have to buy the bundle just to recoup. I think that's what we're gonna do. I think we're gonna do two packs. Justin Ricard's good for salary cap. Come on, last one. Elite, okay. And a Hall of Fame card. The Hall of Fame card probably goes for more than that elite. That was that was bad. That was really bad. What was our best? What was our highest pull? An eighty-seven. Did we pull anything higher than? I don't think we did. I don't think we did. Eighty-seven. Two eighty-sevens. For nine hundred. And 60,000 coins, you can have all this to yourself. 14 elites. Wow, 40k. 
I mean, are these cards at least, these are recently upgraded cards, 40K. All right, well, I'll sell all the stuff and we'll we'll recoup what we can. Uh, we lost coins, we'll open another bundle because I, I, I'm still going to be Lawrence Taylor, so we'll do that. So I hope you guys enjoyed it. I appreciate you guys stopping by. Your support is amazing. And uh, wish me luck. We're going to need it. We're going to need it. <laughs>